So, just coming back to this, this isn't a help me on uh, Ebbers Bashers, by the way. I think that's how you pronounce it. Space heaters. But I have had several. I've got one on the boat. I've got one in the garage for kind of emergency heating. And they're a mixed blessing. They take a lot of getting used to as to what they like and what they don't like. Um, certainly under voltage is one of the things that will just uh, put it into an error. One of the most common ones, I suggest. So you want good thick wires, good 12 volt supply. Make sure you your 12 volt is running at 12 volt and can't drop. So you get uh, peaks when these things start up because uh, they've got heaters inside. And when they first start the heater, which is the igniter, in other words, uh, that can take quite a lot of current, so you can run the voltage under those circumstances. The other thing which is critical, as you notice down the bottom there, the thing is behind the black pipe, that's the tip. And what that's doing is it's forcing the fuel up into the combustion chamber. the ticker pump. So it's coming down out the tank, down into the fuel filter, through up into the ticker pump, with the ticker pump going um, directly up. Which by ticker pump I mean a diaphragm pump, so that's the thing that actually controls the amount of fuel going in. You can't hear it now, but it goes tick, 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 and uh, about once every one and a half seconds is about as slow as it goes and about 8 hertz, 8 times a second is about as fast as it goes and that really controls the uh, fuel load and burn. Once they're up and running they really are effortless but uh, it's kind of getting it right in the first place. Now that's a cheap copy I got off eBay. Proper ever basher will cost you well, 8 900 quid but uh, that one was 85 including delivery, so uh, got some mileage in that and it's outside. You can see no fumes coming off it at all. I might worry a little bit about here, but uh, it's not even warm under there and I can put my hand on the uh, silencer on the end. So uh, just make sure you don't sit down and put your head up against it, but you're probably not going to sit there in the winter anyway. Okay, grand. Let's see, I'll put some marks on the... Uh, tank so I can see my money ticking away. But the load at the moment, between a third and a half a litre an hour, uh, that's pretty cheap heating if it does the heating. But it does. Okay, speak soon.